We're here at the Yokohama Tire LPGA Classic, and I'm here with currently in second place, Sydney Clayton right now. Um, great round, six under. Mm -hmm. What was working for you out there on the course today? You know, I hit the ball really, really well, um, but I also made a lot of putts. Um, it was nice to see on the first hole a putt go in, so to make birdie on the first hole was nice, and it kind of just kept going from there. I made a lot of really good putts. On the second hole, I made a comeback putt for par, and so to make two putt, two big putts on the first two holes is always huge for momentum, and just kind of took it from there. I hit a lot of really good shots, so I gave myself a lot of opportunities. So definitely ball striking, ball striking put me in the position to make putts. You said your put putting was working. You had a birdie, or excuse me, an eagle, actually, on your 17th hole, the eighth hole here. Um, what was your reaction to getting that birdie, or excuse me, that eagle, and knowing it was bumping you up on the leaderboard? Um, it was definitely the most reaction you're probably ever going to see out of me. Um, a big fist pump because um, it was huge. I mean, just to see a long putt go in is great. Um, I got a little help from Maria um, McBride now. I always want to call her uh, Yorth. Um, she had a putt very similar to mine, so to be able to see the speed and her read, it was it was awesome. Okay, now this was one of your best rounds that you actually had on tour here. Um, was there something you're working on coming into this course or anything that you're focusing on? Yeah, I actually uh, just took a trip to Mississippi and saw my short game guide, Tim Yelverton. Um, and we kind of found a key um, the last few days that I was there that's really helped with the putting. And uh, so it obviously has paid off this week so far. Of course. Now an Auburn grad, um, you're so close to Auburn, about I think it's about 60 miles or so away. Mm -hmm. Um, How does it feel to be close to home, or what you would probably call home, and knowing there's a lot of support out here for you? Oh, I love it. I mean, every hole, someone's saying War Eagle. Um, I think my caddy's getting a little tired of it because she uh, doesn't know anything much about Auburn. But, um, but it's great. I mean, I'm staying in Auburn. Um, it is, as you said, it is home for me. I mean, I, I love Auburn, and so every opportunity I can to get back, I do it. So I love it. Was that something important, staying in Auburn? I mean, it is an hour drive each day for you. Was that something you wanted to, where you wanted to stay? You know, every time I play down here, I've stayed in Auburn. Um, I lived in Auburn for a year and a half after I graduated, so I mean, it was my apartment, so it was home um, a few years back. But um, but yeah, I mean, I'm always so comfortable in Auburn, and to be able to be around teammates and um, to be able to play and eat at all the f restaurants that I like to eat at, it's definitely comfortable. So it's like sleeping in my own bed. Okay, big game tonight. What are your plans? Definitely going to watch it. I'm not 100% sure where I'm going to watch it, but I'm definitely going to get staked out at one of our local places in Auburn and watch it. All right, thank you so much, and good luck this week. Perfect, thanks.